Hey YouTube, it's me again. You know what? Be careful what you wish for. <laughs> so, y'all ask for a video, I'm going to give you another one too. So that's, we're just going to walk around the yard, you know. I was going to show you how good some of these plants are doing though. Look at that. Look how well she's took off. She's pretty, isn't she? Remember, she was just a couple little, um, couple little sprigs in there. And she's doing good too. She got a flower. I got her for like a dollar fifty or something at Walmart. It was just real little, and she's got real fast. I see people put those in the ground too, but I think if it sometimes they come back, sometimes they don't. I don't know. And then this pot of goodness. I just stuck a bunch of stuff in there and it's all really did did really well and then I put fake purple flowers in that daisy thing I don't think I'm gonna get any more daisies off of it but I'm hoping I'm just gonna keep it watered and hope that you know next year it, it does something so you know and look how good that red plant is doing in that little concrete pot I didn't think anything would grow good in that but it did so, okay, we've seen that. And look at this one, too. Remember, it was just a couple little sprigs. And look at it. It's doing really, really well. Um, and then I just, like, twirled some empty, you know, that didn't have any leaves on it. I just twirled. Look at that. She's really, really done well. She's got a lot of new growth coming on her. I'm happy about that. It was just, I just laid down, you know how it don't have any leaves, so I just laid down the, um, the vine and put a little bit of dirt over it. So, there's my little, um, pink hooly bob, um, not hydrangea. Why do I always want to say that? Geranium. She's not doing real good. I mean, she's doing okay. She just got that one little baby bloom on her. Ferns are doing pretty good. They're pretty. All right, let's see. Look at my pole. It's, my flagpole is broken. You want to see my new flag? It says, Be Yourself. See, it's got butterflies on it. All right, see, I was trying to sort of do a little butterfly, butterfly theme, you know couple little butterflies I don't know all right oh oh let's look up here let's look at this pretty girl look at this look how big she is she's huge she don't look really big by the fence but that's her that's her new leaf and that's as big as a real elephant's hair ear it's huge I don't think you can see how big it is in person and then that's her baby. She's doing real good too. And then look at my grass. It's so hot I just don't want to cut it, but I'm gonna I'm gonna wait till this evening. Um I just seen dad he was going to church. He said that it was supposed to uh just be in the eighties this week. So we'll see. But I'm thinking about mowing grass this evening. Look, the greenery is really good on her. She doesn't really have a lot of, but the green looks good. She looks healthy. Let's see, look at all that new growth. I got a few buds. This really, this, um, well, this is the first year I've had them too. Um, it's not, this rose bush, these two rose bushes aren't as pretty as what I thought they were going to be. Um, look at the greenery on, on her. She's getting ready to bloom too. Then that little thing right there didn't, didn't do too good. The flocks are pretty up close. I don't know if those are all new blooms or, I don't know. It's my first year of having that too, but I know it'll come back next year. And she looks pretty too. All the greenery looks really good on those. See, she just, she's got a whole lot of growth. She's, um, this is way past my waist. So. That they, they grew really fast. I don't know. I don't know if I like them or not. This is that's the first well, besides that little rose thing that I planted up there, those little mini roses. Um these are really the first roses I've ever messed with. They're not quite as pretty as I wanted them to be. 
She's pretty though. And then, see, I think, um, well, I don't know if, see, I think, see, I think the cat's laid. The cats are pretty rough on my, on my flowers and stuff. I'll tell you that. They're, there's Frankie. That's my girl. That's Mama's girl. Well, this thing is done bloomed. So, I think today, um, if I hurry up and do it, I'll be in the shade. I think I'm going to, um, I want to dig up that shamrock and put it somewhere. It blooms real pretty pink flowers on it. Um, and then these hostas, but look, that hosta actually has some growth on it. That's, they, these have been here for like three, four years. And you see what these look like. But I don't think they get enough sun. At, I don't think they get any sun hardly there. Um, but see where these are so tall, they'll get it. So anyway, I think I'm going to dig this thing up and like take the bobs and just put them all the way across right here. I don't know. I don't know. Hostas are doing good. I need to really get out here and weed and stuff. I just sort of miserable. My four o'clocks, they look real pretty in the evening. They look real pretty in the evening when they're open. See, they're dry. I haven't really watered. I should have watered these better this year, but I really haven't watered. See, I told y'all I had to fight the morning glories, which I'll just mow those down, but um, sometimes they'll grow up the, the vine right here. I, one of them even flowered the other day. That's how I noticed it. Because it had a purple flower on it. They're pretty, but... And then something happened right there. Which, I've got more irises than I need around the yard. See? Morning glory. See all the morning glories? Once you put morning glories in, you are screwed. Because, um, I, I haven't got out here and weeded or anything. I should have weeded it and tried to make it look pretty before I took y'all walk around the yard, but it's just how it is. But let me show you. Let me see. See how it just came? I didn't have the camera on it. Let's see if this one will do it. Nope. Nope. Let me see. But see the end of it? That's just... It's just sort of mushy. And it, um... You know, because I, I try to weed and try to get some of the brown stuff. Look, this one's done. That looks yucky now. I'll have to cut her back. Dad said that the weatherman, which I haven't looked, he said it's supposed to be nice. There's my little fairy garden. I, I need to weed in there real bad, too. Little chairs laying over and stuff. Look, there's the little... The little kids I found at um, the Dollar Tree. <laughs> uh, and here's my little my little set up here. I really like this table and chairs that um, Christy gave me. They look real pretty. Let's look at it again. Nice. That's a step up, isn't it, from what I had. And then, I know I didn't put any concrete in this walkway, but... It's held up pretty good. It's not moving around or anything. And actually, I'm sort of glad I didn't put concrete in it because see how this one's going down? I think I can um, dig this brick up and put something under it. I can level these, you know, because where I didn't do the concrete. And then I might just leave it like it is. But look, my ferns are growing back. I, I got my ferns. Those ferns I showed y'all yesterday, that's where these ferns came from years and years ago. You can just scoop them up because they grow in the moss. And then here's the other two ferns that I got. Those are called, it's got a lot of babies coming. I think that's a Japanese painted fern is what it's called. I got it out of the client's front yard. I took a little piece. Uh, let's see. So it's looking a little better. It doesn't want, I put... Those cats, my dad caught me this morning feeding them too. Oh, well. Um, it's under his house. <laughs> he's, he's not a big fan. Um, but I've been putting blankets and changing them out every couple days. 
I've been scooting a, a nice clean blanket under there for them to lay on because that, that's I'm pretty sure that's what they were trying to do is make a bed and then all of these um, chicken and hens this is what I have found they're messing with them and then I planted them in this pot you know chicken and hens they're they're but they don't last in the ground. They grow great in a pot, but they do not grow in the ground for me. Um, I cut all that lettuce off and put it in a salad, but oh, uh, it was real, real bitter. So it's starting to grow again, but I think the cats, see, they're messing with them. The ones that are hanging over, which is okay. I got a ton of them. I give a ton of them away. And then I had to lay this down because they were pooping in it. Those little flowers. Um, they, the, these were different this year. They, they died back real fast and looked awful. And then look at all this new green growth. So I guess this is going to be the green that it just sort of like got full again. And that's the first year that it's done that. Oh, I know. You're always, always starving. I'm going to clean the pond today, too. I'm gonna take, I haven't cleaned that filter for a couple days. So, that's the yard. You know, I hadn't walked y'all around it for a while. That's what's going on. It's just so hot, and, and I haven't mowed grass. I haven't weed-eated. You know, it is what it is. But... When it gets real, real hot like this, I don't, I don't really enjoy the yard. You know, I, I just, I just stay in the house. And then yesterday we went up to the park, but I about had a heat stroke on me yesterday. I mean, it wasn't that drastic, but it was so hot. I just was melting. And then at one point, me and Mike, um, at one point, me and Mike, um, let's look on my sidewalk, see how it's holding up. Um, at one point, me and Mike sat at a picnic table, and I put my elbow back on it, and it just slid, and I didn't realize that my whole body was wet. Like, my arms were so wet and slick that they couldn't, um, that I couldn't lean because it was sliding. <laughs> it was hot yesterday. Here's all the babies. There's Shug. There's Nosy Rosie. Frankie! There's my Frankie girl. She's my favorite. Um, I shouldn't say that in front of the other cats. You're my favorites too. They don't know. All right, so that's it. Be careful what you wish for, YouTube, because you just might get it.